Hey students, this is Brad Royball, and today we are looking at the Do Now 4.2, which is called the Letters of a Word. So the whole point of this is that we have this starter project you can see right here, and we want to read and run the script. So the first thing I'm going to go ahead and start is click the flag. So you can see the first thing that it does is basically says the letter H for one second. And what we want to do is, once we understand how it works, modify the script so that the sprite says every letter in the word. So to get started, the way this sprite or this uh, script works, just to kind of walk through it, is we basically click the flag. That's our starting condition. We say we want to set the word. So word is a variable we have right here, word. We set word to happy, and then we want to say letter one of the word for two seconds. Um, so I change it to two, but basically it just says the letter of a word. That's kind of the main component right here is this letter portion. Um, what we want to do is set it up so that it says every single letter of the word. So um, I've seen this before, but you may have not, but basically this sounds like a job for a loop. We basically want to iterate through every single letter of the word. What I'm going to do is do my four block right here. So this four block is really useful because it goes a defined um, amount that basically can change kind of, and you can, not only does it go through a defined amount, what makes it different from just this repeat 10 right here is that we have a variable that changes every single time we go through this for loop. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to snap, say letter one of word for two seconds. I'm gonna change I right here to letter one. Um, and again, we've seen this in some of the uh, lesson three labs before, so this should be somewhat familiar, but we're basically going to take it and we're going to do from I from one to the length of happy. And how we find that, I believe, is in variables, and I'm going to see if I can find it. Da, da, da. We should be able to do, I believe, length of should be what I want to do. So I'm going to go ahead and click length of and then we're going to do the variable word. So now we should do from I equals one to length of word, and we should say letter I, and again, that's my iterating value, that's my, my step counter. Um, it, it's really important to kind of understand what this variable is trying to do. So if we click it, oh, no, we're getting expecting a list. Let me see if I have, and I apologize, just bear with me for a minute. Letter, okay, there we go say letter, oh no, we're already using that. I want to do length of. So this is what I want right here, I apologize. So go to variables, word is a um, variable. It's gonna do length of word. So it's gonna say letter I of word for two seconds. So if we go ahead and click, go H, A, P, and then it goes ahead and continues on throughout the script. So again, that's how you do. That's actually pretty much all there is for Do Now 4.2. It's rather simple. Um, and this is going to sort of lead into how we use lists later on and how we kind of iterate through that. Um, I know we've used loops before, we've used variables before, but this, you know, I, ca I counter right here is, is really important when we come to iterating through um, something that we may not know how large it is. So that's how you do Do Now 4.2.